Hi everyone and happy Pride Month. I'm going to show you how to make your logo into a Pride Rainbow logo. Alright, so I've used Nike here, my own logo, Nike and Apple. So here we are with the Nike logo, but it's a, an SVG file, or sorry, a PNG file. And Adobe Illustrator cannot uh, work with a PNG to make a logo, um, logo into a rainbow. So we have to convert it to vector file that the software understands, pixel, uh, not pixels. So in this case, to work around that, we're going to use uh, the image trace option which is under Windows image trace and you just go through the options are very straightforward just click ignore white to get rid of the background you can also preview it and you click trace from here the second step is to expand the option so that uh, Illustrator picks it up as an object and you keep these selected plus OK and the last thing is to go to our Pathfinder tool right here and convert it into a compound shape. Alright so those are the three steps we took image trace um, expand and compound shape should be ready now to to work with our rainbow logo so to make the background of the logo you simply uh, take the rectangle tool and just create colors create a, a rainbow like so and when you're done doing that you just select everything and group it command G into a group this one's already a group and you want to fit it to the logo make sure that the pattern is behind the logo select both the logo in the, the rainbow and now you're going to convert uh, make a compound path shape and to do that, you can just select Command 7 or go to Object, sorry, Clipping Mask, Make. Not Compound Shape, uh, Clipping Mask, and you click Make. So there we go. It's very simple. If you wanted to change the background a bit more, maybe edit it. Go to Clipping Mask, Edit Contents, and you can move things around uh, until you like it. Now I'll do the same thing to the, the Apple logo. I converted this one. So it's image trace. You select the ignore white and you select trace. From there, we go to object, expand. I've already expanded it so it won't show the options. And then you go to Pathfinder, make compound shape. Okay, again, I'm going to just bring over the background, make sure it's behind the object, and adjust. It select both the logo and the rainbow and then just command 7 for clipping mask. You can always go back, edit contents, move it around.